So tutorial time guys, I'm gonna run through the new castle themes in the mighty quest for epic loot. As introduced by patch 17, you can now change the theme of your castle. You can change to aged oak to royal opulusian, which is the world the castle and the heroes live in. You can choose spiky spire. Golden Palace or Spooky Keep. I ran a short trip in Spooky Keep and I really like that. But I'm gonna say that the last. First off, you can buy these themes for Bling. Bling is in game currency bought by real life currency. You can purchase Bling by going to the website and you can buy 2800 Bling for 25 euros. So let's do a quick calculation here. What does that mean? That means that you have to pay. Um, if my calculator will work, seems it won't. So I'm gonna just gonna do the calculation first. That means you get 117 bling for 1 euro, which translates into 475, which passes into 4 euros for a theme. Hey Nish Huck, welcome to the stream. Nice to have you here. Yeah, so it's 4 euros for this and 5 euros for that, basically. Did I say 5 euros? I did, didn't I? So it's... it's... 5 euros? It's about 8 euros, actually. So I can actually put the game in the background. Okay, so I'm gonna do the tutorial on Castle Guys. Hey guys, it's Firekin the Yellow Mage. I'm gonna do a tutorial on the new castle themes introduced with patch 17 in the Mighty Quest for Epic Loot. So what are castle themes? In short, the castle theme is the layout of your castle how the walls look and how your carpets look, how the texture of the walls, textures on the ground, etc. And some of the castle themes actually give you an ambient uh, feeling in the inside the castle. So let's check it out. If you can afford it, you can take a look at the different castle themes by pressing the castle heart or F4. And by pressing the info button on the different types of themes. So. What are they? You can choose the oak look by change, changing the castle theme to aged oak. You can get the spiky tower theme by changing into this, the golden palace and the spooky keep, or you can just keep the current one you have. You can purchase different types of castle themes for bling, and bling is the in-game currency, purchased by real life money. This translates into 475 bling for one of the lesser themes and nearly a thousand bling or actually 975 bling for one of the more improved castle themes. If you want to know what that's in real life money you have to pay 4 euros or 8 euros give or take. So let's go through the different castle themes. Let's play the current one. This is the current and the default theme of the pack I have. Looks sturdy and solid. There are no ambience in here. Torches. Yeah. So this is just a 
typical look. It's a bit rustique, I think. Lots of wood and rocks. Looks like a hard keep to attack. But it's just aesthetics. It doesn't actually make any difference if you choose one or the other. Not much to say. You can see the nails and the boards on the ground. The walls are just granite looking like rocks. Maybe an oily surface to them. This is the theme I'm most familiar with. As you enter the wall room, it's silver, it's rocks, and it's... Yeah, that was the egg though. Looks awesome. So this is the default one. Let's check that one out. Can I do it like this? No, it still shows the... Oh, it shows the, the typical one. It has the wooden floors uh, replaced by granite. And it has these symbols here on the walls. Not sure what they are about. Camera turning, that's a nice feature. Not sure if I approve of it, but hey. Like the ground target area effect you can see here where you actually gonna take damage. That's fairly nice. So let's just check this out. Hmm. Fairly easy. So to comment on the theme of the game, still a good theme. This is the free one. I thought it had a goldish look on the icon, but that could be just for the looks of it. Hey anything man, welcome back to the stream. Yeah, so I guess some personal changes can be made. This is silver here, but on the picture on, on the overview it was gold look. The aesthetics of the keep is more cartoonish, I think. Not sure if I have proof that this is a good thing. Yeah. If you ask me, I prefer the age joke uh, over the current theme. Uh, I like the wooden parts of the castle more than I like the the tiled floor. Okay, they change the ability to throw spells through the walls. That definitely makes a big difference for the mage. Not much though. But some. So this mouse I actually got stuck in the wall. If you noticed, I was actually out of the way. This is just gonna be a short stream. Just gonna review the new castle hunts. Or castle themes if you wish.
So this is the current theme. Not much to say about it. I think I'm just gonna skip through it. Uh, this is the standard one, the default. So I'm just gonna leave castle here. And then we're gonna have a look at the spiky spire. Let's check it out. This could be the one I'd go for if I purchased a theme. This is more of a, a darker look. This, the tile has changed to a more dark tone. You have this metallic spikes on the walls. Looks sturdy and ogre-like. So this is more if you're a World of Warcraft player. This is more in the in the look of Orkroma, I think. At least the knowledge I have of World of Warcraft, which is very limited. The banners are now dark and purple-like instead of red. It has more grey theme. The torches are not framed anymore. They are open. Purplish star. Or Bordeaux. If you're into different color themes. The boss room. Slightly more grey taint over it. I like the work they did on the torches. You see it like this? No. The wall seems like the same. So that was the spiky spire. Cost 4 euros. Then there's the golden palace. Let's check that one out. I bet this place even have gold toilets. Toilets not included. That's nice to know. Let's see if we can find a toilet. So this is more of a white tone to it. Hmm. So this is more of a church church feeling and it even has the church spell and the chanting. The gold looks like gold. The torches aren't really torches, more of a lantern. Definitely bigger impact on the game. More clinic. Has some more an Irish feeling to it. Maybe it's just the symbol that makes me feel like an Irish. Oh, this was orange. Yeah, red, yellow, oranges. Oh, I don't like this. That's definitely a texture fault. So... I don't prefer this one. I don't like it, actually. It has a nice look to it, but it has too many texture faults compared to the other one I saw. Spooky Keep. So I ran through this and I can see why the Spooky Keep and the Golden Palace costs more. Also has a team music and blue flame indicating that a mage is near or a witch. If you believe in the law or mythology of witchcraft, torches on the walls, blue flames. There's a slide fog in here, which is quite awesome. It's more pale. I think I prefer this one. 
change hanging from the ceiling. I'm interested in the boss room to see what they did to it. If they did anything. Like these small spiky shields. So it has some of the spiky keep to it, but still. It's not the same. I like how it differentiates from the 4 euro one. Hmm. This is okay, I think. It doesn't clip like in the Golden Palace. And I like the, the symbol here, the Y. Three times a charm. This symbolism. Castles up here. Castle Heart is the same look on all, all the, the themes, and the walls are the same as well. And they move the the structures from from your castle in here, rather than outside. I can't go out because I ventured in here. I'm not a fan of that. They should move these back out. You couldn't actually use them. So that's a quick review of of the new five castle themes. And personally I prefer the spooky one. And my least favorite is the, the current or the golden palace. If I had to ch choose one of the cheaper ones I think I'd go with the aged oak over the spiky spire. So thanks for watching and let me know in the comments below what you prefer.